video on how to remove a uh, radio from a Ford Ranger or a Mazda B series truck. Um, this is the easiest, simplest way, uh, and I wanted to put it on the uh, internet because some of the other videos they show making tools, and even though they're simple tools from a coat hanger or using four screwdrivers, it's really uh, overthinking it. All you need is four nails, and let me show you. The nail, each nail is about three and a half inches long. These are roughly uh, three, maybe it's, they're about an eighth inch in diameter. So that's all you need is four nails. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna push each nail into the hole. There's four holes in the front of the radio. You can actually feel the resistance and you push it in just a little bit beyond the resistance. And you can see I'm doing this with one hand, my left hand. And you just do that. It's really easy. You push it in a little bit into the resistance there, and then you should stop. And then all you're going to do is spread these out. And I can't do this with one hand, and I can't film at the same time, but I'm going to try. So bear with me. All right. I'm just going to spread these out. The right one to the right, the left one to the left. Basically just pull them out, and that's it. That's all you do. So one more time to review, the right nails go to the right, the left nails you push to the left, at the same time you're pulling and wiggling the radio out. Now you can see right here, here's a view of the clip itself. See how the nails engaged into the clip? It's almost like the factory tool. And so it's pretty easy to do. All you need is a nail. Slips right in, you can see where it's engaging, you can just push it a little bit beyond, and when you pull these out, you see what happens? It's actually pulling that clip inwards, which releases the radio. Simple as that.